from the only movie star who's resisted the cult of superhero movies. Because you know, one at a time, comes a smash hit full of real planes, real sets, and real action. He may have really started a war at the end there. Guy takes his craft that seriously. Top Gun Maverick Tom Cruise returns in his iconic role as Maverick for a film about how Tom, I mean Maverick, may be old. The future is coming, and you're not in it. But Tom, I mean Maverick, won't go down that easy. Your kind is headed for extinction. Maybe so, sir, but not today. Because Tom, I mean Maverick, refuses to die, no matter how many dumb stunts Tom or Mav pulls for Mission Impossible or the Navy or whatever. Teachers have been telling us their jobs are hard for years, but now a blockbuster will make their complaints look interesting. Watch Maverick have to teach the next generation of full-grown adults who go by their gamer tags. Phoenix! Hangman. Payback. Fanboy. To forget going by the book. Forget playing by the rules. It's dogfight football. Offense and defense at the same time. And you know what? Just forget thinking entirely. Life's easier that way. Don't think, just do. Don't think, just do. Don't think, just do. Don't think, just do. What the hell were you even thinking? You told me not to think. As he teaches his students the most important lesson of all. If you ever get in big trouble, call your boss's boss to yell at them. You get yourself in trouble, Iceman makes a call, and you're back in the air. For reasons known only to the Almighty and your guardian angel, you've been called back to Top Gun. Thank you for your service, Daddy. Speaking of nepotism, Maverick will take Goose's son Rooster under his wing. He's determined to follow in his father's footsteps and entire face. But first, he must let go of blaming Maverick for his father's death. And Maverick must make Lieutenant Rooster less of a cock. Increase to 500 knots. Negative, Yale. Hold your speed. Rooster, we're late. We're 20 seconds behind and drop it. Come on, Rooster, you got him. Drop down and take the shot. Too late, you had your chance. Damn it. Yeah, Rooster is a pretty lame call sign, but it's still miles better than Bradley Bradshaw. Bradley Bradshaw. Mav, Brad Brad, and the rest of the gang have just three weeks to pull off mission extremely difficult. Your target is an impact point less than three meters wide between two mountains. Assuming you avoid crashing into this mountain, you'll climb straight up into enemy radar while losing all of your airspeed. To the point where using killer drones seems like the more humane choice. Yikes. But if you want to end your movie with a high-stakes dogfight, you can't go wrong with watching pilots zoom through a canyon trench, staying low under the enemy guns and aircraft, launching a precision-guided missile down the ventilation shaft of an enemy doomsday weapon without the use of their targeting system, and surviving thanks to the last-second intervention of a cocky bad boy, even though all they really did was kick off a much bigger conflict. In the next one, they'll reveal a MiG-29 was secretly Maverick's father. Yet. Enjoy the rare legacy sequel that actually works by weaving callbacks and characters into the story instead of forcing in cameos and references. Wait, you can do that? I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Like Maverick buzzing the tower to save the jobs of his colleagues. <laughs> bringing back Iceman, but evolving their relationship. And the return of Kelly McGillis. No? And the return of Meg Ryan's photograph. Because, ew, the love interest actually aged in the last 36 years, instead of whatever it is Tom Cruise does to spit in the face of death. Let's just pretend that one line about the Admiral's daughter is Jennifer Connelly now. Penny? Phew, that was close. Almost considered my own mortality for a sec. So strap in for the ultimate Jets Go Vroom spectacle. that's been called out by the woke mob for being blatant military propaganda. But they are just butthurt, because America is number one, we do nothing wrong, and we have no problems whatsoever. Now where's the recruiting booth? I want to play some topless beach football. U.S. ass, U.S. ass, U.S. ass. Starring Captain America, the Sprinter Soldier. My name is Bradley Bradshaw. You killed my father. Prepare to fly. Hulk smashed. D. C. K. Still Pullman. Phoenix Flight. Ace Aviator. Lawrence of Arabia. Sad Martigan. Depression is caused by the souls of dead aliens. Admiral Wackbar. Dick Seaman. 
when they open the movie with Danger Zone. Nice. When they don't play Take My Breath Away. Damn. And G4 sing out a big dump. <laughs> Hot Shots Part Cruise. People wasted all this time arguing over what country they bombed when the real enemy was right in front of us the whole time. Birds. Bird strike! Bird strike! Tom Cruise has been in movies since 1981, and he's put up some serious numbers on screen. We watched every film he's ever made to bring you his total career running stats, hang time, and every one of his character's actual height. Click the link in the description or the thumbnail on the right to watch a brand new episode of By the Numbers, Tom Cruise. Uh-oh, snapping back to reality. Oops, there goes gravity. Mom's spaghetti. It's my money, and I need it now. Wonder Boy, what is the secret of your power? I made a milkshake, and all the boys showed up in my yard. 